What is up guys, it is the Turtle Girl. Welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel. Today I'm giving you an update on the live plants in my Diamondback Terrapin turtle tank. Um, a couple months back I made a video entitled the solution to keeping live plants for turtle tanks and it was about these plants that I was adding to the aquarium with the aquarium co-op easy planters and I told you guys I would give you an update so this is that long awaited update also thank you so much to all of you for your comments of support on my last video about Nemo it really means so much to know you all cared for him and I figured it would just be nice to get a little update on Hoku after such a sad video like that so let's take a look all right so here you can see the tank pretty much the same as the last time tank looks kind of dirty but this is real life guys my tank is not always gonna look immaculately clean you can see that Hoku is shedding that's a piece of skin right there and there's Hoku always trying to take a look at what we're up to but these are the plants so if you remember this was the dwarf sagittaria and this is the java fern so as you can see the java fern is actually doing hello hoku the java fern is actually doing pretty well you can see that there's actually like this whole piece of new growth coming out here and then also if we look at the end it's kind of behind this log but there's also some new growth like right around here and so that is the java fern and then over here we have the dwarf Sagittaria, which as you can see, it's not dead, but it's also not doing so hot. There's a bunch of like algae on it and I'm just not completely sure. It hasn't put out runners or anything, which I'm honestly not surprised about because although I have been dosing with like liquid easy green and stuff, I, I don't know, I'm just like, I'm not sure. Everything in this tank always grows algae. So let me know your guys' tips. And then also, I did actually get some, I believe this is water wisteria. You can see it right up there. A nice little piece of water wisteria. And initially when I first got it, it was actually, oh, it doesn't want to focus on it. I'm sorry. Initially when I got it, it was actually growing pretty well, but this wave maker actually kind of pushed it around and some of it got caught in there. So I'm not too worried about it. If it lives, that's great. If it doesn't, I'm not that good at plants anyway, so. But I do have a topic of discussion because when I originally put out this video, I said I needed names for these plants. And so I have been stuck between two sets of names for the longest time. So it's either Barry and Sherman or Pepsi and Sprite. I couldn't decide. Pepsi and Sprite or Barry and Sherman for the names of the plants. So let me know in the comments which pair you like better uh, for the plant name so I can decide what to name these plants. I mean, Sprite slash Sherman is not looking all that great, but uh, you know, that's kind of how it goes. If you guys have any tips, please leave them. And then also, of course, Hoku. He is doing quite marvelous, actually, and eating and swimming around when my camera is not on the tank. He's usually just swimming all around here. He actually really likes to chillax underneath this log. And then you see that little nub right there? He likes to rub his shell on that nub. I don't know if you can tell, but his shell looks a little rough. I feel like he's kind of coming upon that age where he's gonna start shedding. So I'm kind of just waiting for that to happen. But in the meantime, he's just cruising around the tank. So that is the short update on Hoku's tank. Thank you guys so much for watching and again, thank you so much for the love and support on Nemo's video. I'm still, I don't think I've fully like realized that he's actually gone. It's just so strange because his tank is still there. It's just empty now, but I am so, so grateful for all of the stories you guys shared in the comments and how he inspired you and all of that. It really means so much and my arm is getting tired <laughs> holding up this camera, but it really means a lot. I'm, I'm slowly but surely kind of just getting over it, but I wanted to give you guys an update and keep the videos coming. I have a lot of cool things planned. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next Friday. Have a totally awesome day. Bye-bye.